Every single day trader that exists is looking for the perfect scalping indicator. That one thing that's gonna give you the cutting edge to be a better trader. I'm here to tell you there's no magic indicator that is 100% correct every single time to give you a 100% win rate, but I'm gonna show you a free indicator to take your scalping to the next level. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. My name's Artie and this is The Moving Average, a show where we discuss everything day trading to keep you profitable on a consistent basis. So as you guys know, I'm a huge fan of indicators. I believe that computers are there in place to give you information that you can't regularly see, either because you don't have the skill set yet or you can't calculate as much information as a computer can. So, if you watched my previous video about doing a full breakdown on naked trading, setting up your support and resistance levels, drawing your trend lines, and getting your entries based on that information, then you know how to trade without any indicators. And now if you toss an indicator on top of that strategy, that's gonna get you your perfect entry point for every single trade. So without jabbering on for another 18 years, let's jump into the computer. I'm gonna show you exactly how to set this up and how it was created. All right, so this is the exact same chart that I did in my previous video, marking up support and resistance levels and then showing you guys trend lines and breaks in trends. God, I love coffee. So what I normally do after I mark up all these charts is put my indicators on. Now, if you have the free version of TradingView, you are very limited to the amount of indicators that you can put on. Your maximum number is three. I've struggled for a while to show you guys a decent way to set up your charts only using three indicators, but now that is no longer a problem. Let me show you how it used to go. I used to put up three smoothed moving averages. So I would have to click this three times and that would immediately take up all three of your indicators. Then I would put up an RSI, then the stochastic RSI, and then the engulfing candle indicator. Right now that's six indicators on your chart to help you get a better entry and it's too much. Not everybody can have that many indicators. Then you have to go in and adjust the settings for each one of those to make it specific to how I teach in my videos. And now officially as of last night, that is no longer an issue because now we have the moving averages official free indicator on TradingView. So let me delete all this mess and show you exactly how to set it up. So in the description of this video is going to be a link to the Discord group. It's here in the description, so you're gonna click show more in the description. And right here, there's an invitation link to the Moving Average official Discord group. You're going to click that link. It's gonna take you to Discord. If you don't already have an account, it's really quick and easy to sign up. And to get access to the group, you just need to do a quick verification to make sure that you're actually a human being and not a robot scammer. Once you do that verification, there are different categories here. This is where I post my new videos every single day that I do a video. Different announcements that I wanna tell you guys about. We have a general chat room, Forex room, crypto room, indices room, commodities room if you're selling oil and gold. We have a room specifically for beginners, for people struggling with the basics. A full area of testimonials, different spreadsheets, best brokers to choose. And my favorite place to talk is the off-topic chat. We talk about bikes, computers, vacations, sitting outside, playing at the park. This is where the action happens and that's where I spend most of my time. So that's just a quick rundown of the Discord group, but right here in the first tab where it says TMA, at the bottom here we have the TMA indicator. What you're gonna wanna do is click each one of these links and it's gonna take you to TradingView to show you that exact indicator and right here, if you scroll down just a little bit, you click this add to favorite indicators. You're gonna do that for both links. Click the blue button. Now, just to avoid any issues, refresh the page. Up at the top, you're gonna click the indicators search bar and right here in your favorites, it should pop up. It is called the Artie and TMA divergence indicator. Click both of those and they will be tossed on your chart. Now, you do not need to adjust any of the settings. All of the settings on here are the exact settings that I have in each one of my videos of how I like my indicators set up. Okay, so to quickly summarize my strategy, if we are above the 200 period moving average, we are looking for buys. If we are below the 200 period moving average, we are looking for sells. On this indicator, 
indicator. You get the white line, which is the 21 period moving average, the green line, which is the 50 period moving average, an additional 100 period moving average, which is the yellow line, and the red line, which is the 200 period moving average. All of these are smoothed moving averages. They're the ones that I prefer trading with the most. And just to visually represent if you're looking for buys or sells at that time, there is a light cloud from the current price to the moving average, which is either red or green, depending on if it's an uptrend or a downtrend. Now you guys know that I like to trade big ass candles. So the previous indicator I used to use was the engulfing candle indicator. That only shows you if a candle is engulfing the previous candle in the opposite direction. So that is now on this indicator as a built in. You will see that with these small individual arrows. We also have an additional one, which I am extremely excited about because one of my favorite videos that I have made is called the three line strike that video is right here but basically we're looking for a pullback to a moving average and then a big engulfing candle off of that moving average so on a sell signal you want three consecutive bullish candles and then one big engulfing bearish candle that is a three line strike. Three line strikes on this indicator are shown as a double arrow right there. So according to the strategy, the price breaks below the 200 period moving average. We wait for all the moving averages to line up in order, the 21, the 50, and the 200. Price usually pulls back to the first moving average, the 21, and rejects off of it. This right here would have been your entry candle with a bearish engulfing. This one right here would have been an even stronger entry point with a three line strike bearish engulfing candle. Each one of these, you double the length of that bearish engulfing candle for your stop loss and you keep your risk to reward at a two to one. Both of these entry signals got your two to one risk to reward ratio and just this alone is absolutely amazing. It gives you a clear indication of my strategy so that you don't have to add too many indicators. Everything's just there for you and you don't have to adjust the settings. The other benefit of this indicator, as I have discussed in a previous video, how to back test properly. You can watch that right here. So when I showed you guys how to back test, I told you to only look at the times that you normally trade every single day. And with this indicator, you get a blue cloud showing you exactly your trading window, which you can adjust in the settings. Right here in the inputs, the fourth menu option down, you can select the time zone, either to the New York session or the London session, or even the Tokyo session. And most of you guys are in the US, so you're just gonna leave this at the standard settings on the American session. You can also choose which days of the week that you trade. So if you don't trade Monday or Friday, because those are like trap days, you can just untick these two boxes and you won't get a cloud over that period. Small adjustments can be made, but you literally do not have to change any of the settings of this indicator. I don't really like using the 100 moving average, so we actually gave you an option to turn that off, and that'll remove the yellow line, and you'll just get the white, the green, and the red. Now, you guys know that I'm a huge fan of using the RSI to show you the momentum, which direction the price is gonna go. I like to be looking at buys when I'm above the 50 level on the RSI and sells when I'm below the 50 level on the RSI. So the standard way that I have my RSI set up is the RSI is yellow. There is no upper band and no lower band. There's no cloud here. It's just got a standard line across the 50 showing me bearish momentum and bullish momentum. And what's added on here as a benefit is kind of like a floating moving average between that 50 level across different time frames. So whichever time frame you're on, this additional white line is gonna give you a better representation of when it actually drops into that downtrend momentum or conversely uptrend momentum. So at this point right here, we crossed below that floating moving average and right here is gonna be your entry point. Cross reference that with your big engulfing candle indicator and you could have actually waited for this move to be 100% positive to get here. Either one of those two entries would have still got you in profit. And the last thing that this indicator does for you guys is give you and show you a visual representation of 
divergences. So you guys know I like to use divergences to show me a reversal in the trend. Divergences happen when you create lower lows on the price action and higher lows on the RSI. So right here we have two lower lows. Let's draw a trend line across that and you can clearly see it. Now looking at the RSI at that exact same time frame, we are creating higher lows. This indicator now prints a bullish divergence signal on the RSI for you. Once you got that signal, you have a general idea that the trend might start reversing at that point and you can get in on the trend reversal to the upside. This indicator literally does everything that I teach in every one of my videos. Now, if you pair this with marking up support and resistance levels as I taught in my naked trading video and we get a fat rejection off of a previous level of resistance creating a new support, with a big three line strike, bullish engulfing, high up on the RSI, you can take these positions to the next zone. This is gonna be your ultimate way to trade. Do your markups on your chart, toss up the indicators that we provide for you guys for free, and you're gonna be very successful in your day trading. I've been wanting to do this for a while and I've been talking to developers, but luckily just I don't know how it happened, but somebody in the community decided to take the initiative, likes what I'm doing and giving free education and free information to people, and he decided to create this indicator based on my entire trading strategy, and now we're offering it to you guys for free as long as you join the Discord group and just click those links. That's the mission of this channel, to get everybody to quit the job that they hate, to make money online, to work whenever they want, wherever they want. And this is just another step in the process to getting all of you guys in profit. I'm so incredibly thrilled about this and I really hope you guys take advantage of this. So if you have not already joined the Discord group, put those indicators in your favorites list and start getting profitable. To really utilize this indicator and this strategy to the fullest, you must first understand support and resistance levels. So learn that first by watching this video right here. And if you guys got some value out of this video and you like the way that I teach and you appreciate all the stuff that we are all doing for you guys, make sure you're subscribed to the channel by clicking this button right here. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Dude, this is seriously like a game changer.